Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to Since Day One. Before we get into this video about NBA Youngboy's new girlfriend, Days Rose Gold, as well as Kentrell himself and Days' mom, go ahead and like the video, comment down below, and if you are new, smash that subscribe button to take flight with us. Fake love, I don't need it, you can keep it, that's a fact. I, I had to make up my mind, my mind. Tell me why Days Rose Gold seen her opportunity to dip and she took it, y'all. So y'all know these shade rooms, they be on one, y'all. They will keep up with YB's entourage as if they is sisters, mothers, and uncles. Well, of course, the shade rooms was gonna find out that Days Rose Gold went home, but I told y'all this yesterday that girl didn't dipped and took the car too because YB wasn't around to see it. I bet you Days Rose Gold was watching them shade pages like a hawk, y'all, trying to see. As soon as YB landed in California, she was on her way to Florida. You're right. That's what I said. But as soon as I got my check, I was gone. And y'all know that Porsche Panamera ain't got no miles on it. So what was it today to push the pedal to the metal, y'all, and make it to Florida? Now, y'all, I looked it up. And from YB's house to Boynton Beach, Florida... That's 12 hours and 44 minutes, y'all. Something had had to put some fire up under Dej Ace, y'all. Because, I mean, look, you had to be super duper mad or have a huge plan to put into effect to have took that drive by yourself. I mean, I'm just saying, girl, because you, I mean, what's the play? Because I know you could have took a flight, girl, but you couldn't ship the car. How was you going to get the car back? Okay, so Dej said get stuff the trunk let's make a move so y'all i'm guessing these shade pages allegedly found deja's mom's facebook page and we just gonna call her mama rose so one of the shade rooms have found that mama rose posted this on her facebook and you can see that her location is boynton beach florida and i'm guessing that's where Dej had went to went on back to her mama house Cause at the end of the day Dej ain't gotta be nowhere she ain't wanted the caption read, I'm back home with my family. I'm happy and so excited to get back in the studio tomorrow. Big things coming from me. Well, when I seen that the shade rooms have found her social media, I went on Facebook to go see what she was talking about, y'all. But before we get into all of that about Mama Rose, let me go ahead and read these tweets that Dej has been tweeting, y'all. Because it sounds like she big hungry, big sleepy, big pregnant, and big in her feelings. So Days Rose Gold starts off, keep my mouth closed, it be too much on my mind, don't nobody care, I won't dare waste my time, which y'all know is some song lyrics by the way. She continues, today was okay but I've been feeling sorrow so tonight I'ma pray it's better by tomorrow. And then she said I can't even be home comfortably because people are weirdos walking all up in my yard taking videos of my car like are y'all that fanned out? But as you know as soon as you came out with that black eye people have been worried about you girl. But then again, you know why we got fans everywhere and they all trying to get a dollar for a picture. And then to control subliminally, she says, why I can't treat you right? Because you the wrong ninja. And then she said, I'm sleepy AF. I just want to watch Walking Dead and eat hot fries till I pass out. Don't that sound like some cravings? And then she was like, my grandma cooking my favorite food. The supporter replied, my grandma been acting like she don't F with me since she got married. And Dave said, that be that hurt. And then Dej continued, sometimes you gotta lay down and bleed a while so the world can feel your pain. And you gotta be able to read between the lines, you guys, when we see in these tweets, y'all. Dej is basically saying that we're gonna have to wait for her to release some new music because I know that it's gonna be fire and I know that she's gonna be telling plenty stories about what was going on in YB's house. Please don't think that Dej Rose Gold was one of the gullible ones and didn't get nothing before she left. Anyway, Days Rose Gold continues, ninjas show fake love that ain't real. Just trying to catch a better vibe because I got lost in my thoughts and I cry. I mean, yeah, everybody gonna feel how they want to feel at the end of the day. Maybe feel like Dej was dumb or stupid for putting herself in a predicament like that to maybe gain something that was permanent that she couldn't get rid of. Maybe to get pregnant, maybe to get a bag, maybe to get a feature. We'll all never know why Dej Rose Gold was really chilling around YB and letting him dog her out the way he was. We really will never know what 
happened or what's going on. But the fact is, is that Dage Rose Gold is no longer at YB's house. She's back in Florida doing her thing with or without the Panamera. I feel like Dage will be good. I've been seeing a lot of comments where y'all are saying that sh that the car is going to get repo, that he's going to come and get the car back, that the car has a tracker on it so he knows where she's at. It's not like she hiding, y'all. If he want the car, come get the car. She back home now. And plus, y'all, Days Rose Gold is really the only one who left with something besides a baby. I feel like Days Rose Gold might even have the same mentality Jania had. Yes, she hurt, but she finna capitalize off that hurt. Y'all seen what Jania did. Days finna do the same thing. But with this one exception, though. Dej has talent and Jania does not. The only thing Jania has right now is her beauty and the fact that YB used her as his bag. I'm sorry to say, but it's true. Y'all listen to me when I say that Dej Rose Gold is going to have a record deal by summer 2020. And I know y'all Jania fans going to be mad at me that I said what I said, but y'all know that it's true. Y'all can't be mad at me. Jania is pretty. I give her that. She's gorgeous. I give her that. She has a great smile. I give her that. She's very prosperous. Her business is booming and all the above. I give her that. But if Jania had not met YB, Jania would just be another Houston a Anyway, back to Days Rose Gold. Days Rose Gold has talent. She already had her own following before she met up with YB. She was already releasing music and bangers before she met YB. She was already social media influencing by herself before she met YB. So I don't care about all of y'all out there saying that it sounds like I'm riding her, whatever y'all think that I'm riding. But I just state facts. It is what it is. It's women empowerment. If you're doing your thing, you're doing your thing. So let's not get off track. Let me go ahead and let y'all know what I found on Mama Rose Facebook when I was lurking. I gotta get the car. I gotta get it. 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 Let me get in here. <laughs> Child. Leave your thoughts and opinions down below and let me know what y'all feel about this situation and what y'all thinking. But that's not even it, y'all. I got something else. Mama Rose posted these screenshots on her Facebook, you guys, and it said, I am Dave's mother and I work my A off for my children. Y'all idolize this man, aka Kentrell. Okay, he make great music and he's somebody's son. You must keep in mind that Dej is somebody's daughter as well. And I'm not your typical mom. When it comes to hurting my children, my daughter is expecting a child. She is pregnant. Someone sent me screenshots of all the BS y'all talking about. I wish AB would come to my house. She says y'all keep talking ish and don't know ish. And she wants someone to even breathe wrong. I'm happy my daughter home, but I'm still angry and I can't let certain things go. I just, I just can't. Some people need to know they can be touched. I don't care how much money a person got. Some people's silence can't be bought. 
Come to my home and get this tool on your I'm ace. angry. Very angry. How can you girls down talk another when it happens to you? Let's see if you got a mom like me. She even had a message for Arabian saying, Arabian, I know you don't like me, honey, but I came to you like a woman and I apologize. But you went on a rant. I'm 42, not 50. But I meant what I said. You are a beautiful person and I see you have changed a lot. I'm happy because you're the only one with talent and the rest of them itches are trash. Throw the whole garden tool away. Yes, I'm talking about you itches because you itches talking about my daughter. She went on to say, I'm done. Leave my daughter alone, please, before a lot of you end up being served. I'm telling you, I'm not your typical mom. I don't play. I'm going all out about mine on God. I wish a Inja would. Show up in Palm Beach for days. Ooh, please show up. Man, I lived and I learned. I know what's going on and I will die protecting my children. She continues, y'all itches gang up to humiliate my daughter, LMAO. The whole time she got a record deal waiting on her. Now go talk about that. And then she says, stop asking for my Instagram. I don't have one. Look, search fine and get this pressure on your ace i was quiet for a long time but not anymore i truly feel sorry for you ladies y'all praise the devil go to church ladies we make mistakes but god forgives us don't settle for that it ain't worth it find something that you like and build don't let no man make you feel like you need them flip that ish act like a lady and think like them in efforts period so long, so long, sleeping from soap with a soap, from soap with a soap. Now I'ma step on these little bitty bitches. Here's some brand new Gucci loads. I got tired of eating Big Mama's chicken. Now it's business when I want to.